Hello, good uh, good afternoon or good evening, wherever you are. Your script is speaking. I'm going to have a short video talking about crypto exchanger. You know, the crypto exchanger, what we had uh, with the crypto exchanger. Let me just go through the history of crypto exchanger. Just copy. I'm going to go to the, okay. Crypto exchanger, it was actually very hot, very hot ICO. In the first and the two uh, round of ICO, we had really trouble to get this uh, to get the tokens. And when they started, they had some kind of hype platform. Just let me see if you the hype platform that is high investment and they haven't they haven't got it yet okay it was it was in actually in platform different platform different function in one platform it was exchanger it is uh, still exchanger so you can uh, exchange different uh, tokens of different coins to the uh, other ones uh, like a uh, phase shift that is also a change uh, where you can change your um, one electro one <laughs> one, electro, one cryptocurrencies to the other cryptocurrencies this was one of their functions but functions the other one was as i said the high uh, high uh, high yield investment platform so you put money in there and then you had uh, high uh, percentage uh, profit per day up to six percent per day and that is the the second one the third one was their lending platform that was also a very promising lending platform it was very hot very in demand and in the last round of the ICO they said and sorry the, in the first yeah I don't need to thought the second or third um round of ico they they just dropped high uh, investment platform they said okay we are not going to look like pit 50 uh, with with a uh, high yielding um, platform because it's not sustainable so we are going to just get it get it out of our uh, system so then there was exchange and there was a lending platform lending after a while they said actually lending is not uh, sustainable after talking to their um, uh, their lawyers they said actually it is not also sustainable so we are going to drop that one as well so there was only one thing this is a normal ICO one exchange from uh, it goes to exchange you can uh, change one coin to the other one I don't know if there were any um, that you can do any trading in it I don't know because uh, if I look here on their platform exchange they have crypto exchanger let me see if I can get anything you yeah, make exchange exchange history they, that is just change one cryptocurrency to the other one. There is no nothing like uh, QCoin or Binance, uh, Binance or the other ch changes. There is, there is not, not. They haven't got got, got that in their system. Okay, so uh, in order to incentivize uh, people to keep their tokens, because now it is becoming just normal ICO, nothing special about it. So they said, okay, we have been doing not correctly, so we are going to do something good for you. And then uh, the last uh, the last round went really slowly, and I don't think they have sold all the tokens. And there were millions of something of the tokens uh, was left over, so they said they decided to uh, do the airdrop to the people who have uh, take part in the ICO, and the people who are going to take the to to keep their uh, their the tokens 
but, uh, until 25th, 25th of January. And you know, you know they've sent today, they've sent the email to people and they said, okay, we are going to just let me uh, make it bigger so you can read it as I go along. Okay. They said that they are going to have uh, they, they they gone to uh, exchange so they have gone to a stocks exchange so um if i go there just here the price is something like 45 cent and you know on, the, on their site the price is two two dollars nine ninety four cent nearly three dollars okay so this is something you can do with uh, you can do the arbitrage so buy the tokens on the exchange and then uh, somehow sell it here okay and then uh, just let me get rid of this one okay so uh, so you, you see the price is here just 45 cent and this is the last price that is two uh, two nine the close is two nine eight two nine eight yes it's 45 cent and they put it they put their um, token on the exchange they are going to go to different exchanges but because of the holiday season and it hasn't been successful to go to coin exchange or other exchanges but they are going to have a airdrop as i showed you here they're going to have airdrop they said that they have uh, they have made 900,000 uh, available 900,000 tokens available and uh, this value will be sh shared equally amongst everybody while that is, that is for the people who have the tokens you can buy the tokens there on the on the um, on the exchange or if you have IC, they are, ICO they are going to to um, distribute this 900,000 between all the people who have these tokens but in additionally addition they have 100,000 um, EXCC tokens special for the people who have uh, uh, taken part in the ICO okay and they have some condition uh, on people getting it you have to register uh, the airdrop registration will start 20th of January at 9 and ends up 27th of January the snapshot will be taken on 29th at 12 p.m. and after that uh, we have allocated 1 million uh, EXCC coin for the airdrop and they can be found yeah this address where you can find the, um, the uh, number of uh, tokens available and anybody who wishes to receive free coins must fulfill all the conditions and also complete the application form here so you go here and then you do the you fill the application form and uh, it says to qualify for airdrop all claim claimants must meet the following criteria you have to be ico participant having at least 50 es exc coin in uh, in the desktop wallet or crypto exchanger web wallet because they have introduced it for uh, i think um, two weeks ago something like that and uh, okay uh, on the snapshot and you must provide their their un number visible on the C cx account okay so you have some un number uh, just let's see if i can find the un number number i don't know where it is but i'm going to find it anyway this is the un number you have to have somewhere uh, i'm going to find it later on okay let's get back to here okay so you have to have um, you to do certain conditions and also okay the following must be calculated okay 
and Kaliman do not have to register on crypto exchanger.net to participate in this event okay so it means that you can buy uh, buy the EXCC tokens on the exchange and then keep it in your wallet and then they are going to take a snapshot on 20th 20th uh, just when was it 20 20 20 20 yeah 29th 29th of january they're going to get a snapshot and say if you want to buy you have to buy it now and put it in your wallet and they're going to get uh, to put a snapshot and then you can uh, then you will be getting the airdrop they are sending and how to calculate it they have also mentioned here that how do they calculate it if they said they're following uh, the following format will be used to calculate airdrop coins airdrop coins received airdrop coins divided by sum of all exc reported and held okay so that is equal amount uh, times number of coin held by the claimants claimant so uh, if you have more coins you get more coins okay that is uh, that's about it so at the end of the airdrop event we will work out all the calculation and send the exc coins to the registered destination address as soon as possible so this is very good news and there's something else they want to us they want us to inform other people on different uh, uh, different sharing uh, media sharing sites facebook twitter or telegram or wherever that this is going to take place okay that was a quick review on the new development on coin exchange crypto sorry crypto exchanger and i hope you like it you like it give it um, thumbs up subscribe and please hit the notification bell anytime i have new information you'll be the first one to hear about it okay nice talking to you until next video, sayonara.